Now for this bit, we joined up with Chicago's world famous Second City Comedy Group to create a fake improv troupe called the Home Improvements. Now we always play these gags on three or four different people, and here's why. This is our first mark. All right, everybody, give yourselves a big round of applause. I barely get a word out, and the guy recognized me. All right, let's reset, bring in our second mark, and try it again. <laughs> Marty Pitts, I gotta, I gotta put on Chinese eyes or something. Okay, we're 0 for 2. Right. So for the next mark, I put on a fake nose and a huge hat to make sure I'm not recognized. All right, tonight we have a special treat, a special guest in the audience because... <laughs> Oh my God, what do I gotta do? Put a bag over my head? <laughs> Good afternoon, boys and girls. How's everybody doing tonight? This is the home improvements. So this is Rich, our fourth mark, and he definitely doesn't recognize me. Okay, on with the bit. What makes our group different is that every time we play, we bring a totally random audience member up on stage, okay? Okay, is there a rich in the house? Get up there, buddy. Yeah! All right, all right, there, 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 there. Okay, now that we got rich on stage, we're gonna raise the stakes by telling them that there are network TV executives in the crowd, and based on tonight's performance, they might give us our own TV show. Listen, guys, we need this TV deal, okay? You gotta be funny. There's a real TV exec. You gotta be funny, guy. Our future's resting on it. Oh! Alright, alright! Now we're gonna put Rich through 45 minutes of the worst improv ever. Here's a few highlights. Go, Rich! Go, Rich! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Come on, guys! Get the kick! Get the kick! More elaborate! Nice! They're on fuego! He's on fuego, folks! Is there someone in the scene with me? Is the guy in the. <laughs> and that's our show, people! Oh, was that not a great show? That's that great show. That's our show, ladies and gentlemen. Nice plane, <laughs> head. <laughs> okay, we really bombed. And we're blaming Rich. But before he can leave, our TV executives ask him what he thought about the show. All right, let me ask you this one question. Do you think these four people deserve their own television show? No. <laughs> now, Rich had a few more things to say about us. Let's see if he'll say it to our faces. Oh, Rich felt that you guys were, um... Generally unpolished, mm -hmm. uh, not real pr well prepared in general. Oh, really? <laughs> well, I think the bottom line is um, Rich wouldn't watch a TV show with you guys. Why you gotta take a dump on me in front of the network oh. executive? Oh, I'm sorry. Well, so you wouldn't watch our show? I would watch it if it was good. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's great. I've been doing this for almost Eight and a half months. <laughs> and you're gonna listen to this guy? I've been an executive for almost a year and a half, and I think I know who I'd like to listen to better. I don't even know who the hell I'm talking to because I'm looking at a carbon copy because you're all alike, all you TV pieces of crap with your Prada bag and your <laughs> Gucci shoes and your baby. <laughs> Is he yelling at me? Yeah, I am, lady, because I don't need you. I don't need you. And I don't need you, you little TV slut. It's the most entertaining thing I've seen all night. Really, bravo. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go. Oh, we didn't come here for this. All right, take that bag off your head. I'm sorry, please come back. I'm please. Seriously, don't touch me. Really, don't. I'm sorry, I got desperate. Get away, please don't. Please don't touch me. I got desperate. I got desperate. I got desperate. I got desperate. I got you. Don't laugh, I'm dude. Sorry, don't laugh. I'm losing it. You made me look like a fool guy. No. I'm no fool guy. Look at me. <laughs> Can I just let you know something? You know that you've been asked? You're oh on the Jamie my. Kennedy experience. <laughs> 